next step. It's um, I don't know how this is going to work. It's getting pretty late in the arvo here, um, but I'm just going to. I've noticed that like um, a lot of the holes are actually elongated. I think what's happened is the guy that I bought this off, or the guy he bought it off, it, he he put a um, like a I think it was like a fifty uh, a sixties. Um, pick guard on there and he created another hole but what's also happened is some of these other holes have, uh, have been uh, made bigger so I'm gonna I'm gonna actually patch those um, so I'll just do a quick quick video of just how I'm doing I want to try and get this whole process on tape so just got a skewer I'm just gonna cut them into cut them into um, about just over a, probably about a, an inch inch length might be able to hear old giggle and hoot in the background the young fellas watching the giggle and hoot Just get some standard PVA glue. It's just uh, generic brand PVA. Got myself a classic vanilla Coles brand ice cream container. Best ice cream you can get, I reckon. I'm just going to put the glue on the bottom here so I can, um, it's just easy to get to. is just dip me dip me toothpick in the glue and try and get a bit, little bit of that glue in the hole just tap it through and do, do that. Fixing my guitar, sweetheart. So that's 
that's it. I'm just going to wait till that to dry, and then once it's dry, I'll just get me snippers and just cut those off, and then I'll just sand all those back. Um, and I'll just obviously re-drill them when I put the um, pick guard back on. So next time you see this video, I will be sanding the body.